anxiety, apathy, and restlessness. Three things that I have personally struggled with recently. Anxious because plans I had were not playing out the way that I had hoped. I was becoming apathetic at work because at the time the pandemic was making it really difficult for me to know if I was being successful. And I was growing restless because everything in me just wanted to get back to normal. How's that for some vulnerability? And maybe you two have struggled with at least one of those, or maybe like me, all three. One morning, I was sitting at my coffee table in my living room with my Bible open, sitting on a freshly brewed cup of coffee, and I felt the Lord remind me of a psalm I had read just a few months prior, Psalm 37. Trust in the Lord and do good. Dwell in the land and enjoy safe pasture. It's just one of those moments for me where the passive scripture just kind of met me right at the point of struggle. To my anxious thoughts, I heard, trust in the Lord. A simple yet profound reminder when you find yourself trusting in anyone or anything else. All that is going on in the world and in your world, you can trust God. Nothing catches him off guard. His promises still ring true. And in Jesus, our hope remains secure. To my apathy, I heard, do good. Keep doing good. Jesus called us to be the light of the world and in the darkness, light shines the brightest. So let's put action behind our faith and love well at work, at home, and even on social media. And to my restlessness, I heard, cultivate the land. Let's not be like Israel who found themselves in the promised land and began looking beyond it to greener pastures. Be faithful where God has you in the here and now. Rather than wishing away a season, stop and ask yourself, how can I grow through this? What can I learn from this? And who can I help because of this? So trust in the Lord, do good, and cultivate the land. So let us know in the comments, what's one thing you're going to choose to trust God with today?